The usual protocol was relaxed to allow singing from the public gallery to welcome Linda Burney into Australia's House of Representatives. Her kangaroo skin cloak featured the goanna, the emblem of her Aboriginal clan, and her personal totem, the white cockatoo, known as the noisy messenger bird. Referring to her people, she promised to bring the fighting Wiradjuri spirit into federal parliament. The former schoolteacher made history in 2003 after winning a seat in the New South Wales election, becoming the state's first Indigenous MP. She wants others to break down barriers. I spoke earlier of what it was like to be a young Aboriginal girl in the 1960s sitting in a classroom and being told that my capacity was list, list limited by my race and that by my, potential, my potential was capped by expectation. Thanks to the voters in Barton, I hope that there are young people who sit in classrooms like Chloe Nowak from my hometown of Leeton here today, whose imaginations are not limit, so limited. If I can stand in this place, so can they. Never let anyone tell you, you are limited by anything. Linda Burney is the first Indigenous woman elected to the bear pit of Australian politics, the House of Representatives, where she was embraced by Ken Wyatt, the first Aboriginal man to make the same journey. Phil